guys, you are watching the Fatih Network live. We are at the Banjul International Airport to witness the welcoming to the Republic of Sierra Leone, uh, Madam Fatima Dabio, who is honored tomorrow to attend a graduation ceremony at the International Open University here in the Gambia. And part of her visit in the country is also to receive an award that is being packaged for her as the best first lady in Sierra Leone since the history of the country. Madam Bio is right there, and as you can all see, the flight that is coming here. Well, good afternoon, my first you will introduce yourself. Good afternoon, thank you very much for having me. My name is uh, Mahawa Aliyu. I am the information attaché Sierra Leone Mission Banjo de Gambia. Mao, what can you tell us about this uh, purpose of you people have been gathered here today? Well, we're here today um, to receive our astute and uh, most hardworking first lady in the history of the Republic of Sierra Leone, in the person of Her Excellency Mrs. Fatima Mada Bio, who have devoted herself to working for the people of the Republic of Sierra Leone. She is a woman of moral guarantor. She is a woman of standard. And she's been doing her utmost ever since Her Excellency uh, became the, front, the mother and the first mother of the Republic of Sierra Leone. She has been doing a fantastic job. Hence the reason today, the American International University of West Africa have decided to honor her it's not um, just an honorary degree because of knowing her as the first lady. It's because of what she has been doing. She has been going length and breadth in that republic in making sure that our girls are protected. Before this time, a lot of men, particularly older men, we will see them abusing children. It has been a norm in Sierra Leone that men will abuse children of 10, of 5, of 6, and sometimes nothing comes out of it. But when Her Excellency came over and she took over, she said, my priority is my children, the children of the Republic. And hence the reason, in fact, she launched the Hands of Our Girls campaign. This is to tell the men that take your hands off our little girls. These girls are supposed to be in school. These girls are our future for tomorrow. So you don't come and abuse them. And it has been so fantastic. The world is watching. All the people are admiring Her Excellency for the good work that she is doing. So looking at all of what she has been doing, particularly for humanity, she is also a philanthropist. She has been trying her level best in making sure that Sierra Leone become a safer place, particularly for children and women. Gathered here today? Uh, well, um, it's to receive my first lady because um, by history, I am a born of Sierra Leone as well. My dad is a Gambian, so I'm invited here as a special guest to receive her at the uh, foot of the aircraft. Yes. So, uh, what does this visit mean to Gambians and Sierra Leoneans as well? Well, it's a uh, Gambian um, born coming back to her bad place um, th this is the Gambia this, she was here all her life she was married here you know she knows this country and then she has been uh, contributing into the arts and excellence of this country so she's coming home so it means a whole lot to us you know and every Gambian should be very proud of her and let's say every African should be very proud of this woman because she's raising the flag high she's making sure that um, the 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 dream of every woman is seen in her physical um, works. Yeah. Who is this particular woman? That's the first lady of the Republic of the Wall. Not only Sierra Leone, but the Wall. Good afternoon. My name is Ijamu Uh Madam, what can you tell us about the purpose of you people even gathered here today? Um, it's for a very good purpose. We come to honor the first lady of Sierra Leone, who happens to be. Um, a daughter of the soil for Gambia who has done so many charity things all over the world and um, she deserves when we heard that she's been honored we thought it'd be a, a good idea it'd be a fantastic thing for us to come and join and honor her because um, on, give the honor to whom honor is due and that's why most of us flew in from London last night to come and be with her and to say thank you and to appreciate her in everything she has done and she's still doing for people. We are very grateful. That's why we are here. Thank you. 
So on her escort, and you can see the airport is filled with um, residents of Sierra Leone who are who converge here just to show uh, their sign of appreciation and support to the first lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone. Well, that is the flight here that I've just landed and in which Madam, Madam, Madam Bio will soon uh, come down and to receive a rousing welcome here at the Banjul International Airport um, from Sierra Leone. Yes, uh, guys, uh, that is the flight here and Madam Bio is expected to come out here right now as you know. See. Uh, with, her de with her escort team of delegates uh, from Freetown they have just landed at the Banjul International Airport those are the people coming out from the flight who escorted Madame Bio in the country and from the background you can see different people that is Madame Bio who is coming out from the aircraft here and receiving a rousing welcome at the Banjul International Airport we will talk to her soon about her visit in the country. Yeah. And that is Madame Bio, the first lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone, uh, landing with where she received a red carpet reception at the Banjo International Airport. Just to remind you that you are watching us. Here is the first lady of the Republic of the Gambia. We have the first lady of the Republic of the Gambia and the first lady of Sierra Leone, Madame Bio, and uh, receiving a rousing welcome here. Her Excellency, welcome to the Gambia and tell us the purpose of your visit here. Um, I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm coming home, so that's for, it's the most important thing. And of course, I've been invited by the American University, 
who have uh, I don't know but uh, they they see me worthy of um, confiding on me a honorary degree tomorrow hopefully and then we'll see how that goes so what is the feeling anytime you landed in Gambia it feels like home that's it it's home what is the relationship between Republic of Sierra Leone and Gambia? See the way we are holding each other, that's the relationship. Bread and butter. <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, guys, uh, that is uh, Her Excellency Madame Bio of the Republic of Sierra Leone uh, holding uh, with Her Excellency Fat Barbaro of the Republic of the Gambia. As she was the one who received her here at the Banjul International Airport. Well, uh, guys, uh, as you all know, here is the welcoming of the First Lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone, Madame Bio. And Madame Bio is with Her Excellency, the First Lady of the Republic of the Gambia, in this wide Lexus as she received her uh, upon arriving at the Banjul International Airport. Uh, the escort is now heading to Burford Garden where the two first ladies of the two sisters country uh, are expected to have a lunch and also discourse for the issues. Uh, this is just to uh, update you about the visit of Her Excellency, the first lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone, Madame Bio, who is on a state visit here at the, in the Gambia and also tomorrow she will she's expected to attend a graduation ceremony at the international open university where she is also being honored with and with an award that of uh, as the she is being described as the for best first lady in the in africa and and which sierra leoneans uh, residents in sierra, sierra leoneans who are residing in the country also converge at the airport to welcome her excellency to show her the support and the love they have for her Tomorrow is the event at the International Open University. Just to remind you that you are watching the Fat Network live at the Banjul International Airport.